Hey everybody, it's Sherry, the Crafty Decorator. Happy Sunday, everybody. I hope you're having a fantastic day. It's sunny and beautiful here today. A little breezy, but beautiful. I am out on my porch trying to decorate again. Um, I'm working on our boxes, our sign boxes that John and I made this summer. And this one I have decorated for fall. And I'm going to show you what I used and how I did it. I am just loving it. Um, okay, I'm going to push this to the side. So this is our fall flower box that we built this past summer. Um, this is what I use in here, <laughs> these big bunch of foam blocks. And I leave the plastic on. So I stick this in here and the flowers I'm using, I got it on block. Now, I just put these in a Rubbermaid when I take the spring out. I took the spring out the summer and I put them in a rubber mate because I'll reuse those next year. And I didn't have these last fall, so I had to go get some flowers for them. These are from Hobby Lobby. Um, I think they're on sale for $10 a bunch. I think it's $10 a bunch. But I would have got them at Walmart, but they didn't have anything. Because I think Walmarts are like six. So try Walmart, but ours did not have anything left. Because you saw the beautiful ones I got for my urns. So I had to cut them down a little. I had to cut them down because they were too high. So I just start by sticking the two flower bunches. I'm using two of these into here. I kind of try to use the same holes for some of it anyways, but I have two of these, two of these flower bunches. So let's see, I did white up the front there. So I want to use the gold color on this one. I'll fluff them out after I get going here. Okay. Then I got these bunches here at Hobby Lobby. These are on sale for $5. I took one apart because I wanted some short stems for the front. So I took one apart and I just kind of stuck them in the front. I kind of stick them in the front there and wherever you think. Maybe I need one in the middle just to give it some flowers because I'm going to do some pumpkins in here too. Uh, I'm not sure if I'm leaving that one. Not sure I'm leaving that one there. I'm going to wait. Okay, so I have two, two full ones. And I'm going to stick these in the back here. Towards the sides. Because I have one tall piece left. And I kind of just spread them out. I know some of you will say break them apart. But then they're too short. So I am just going to spread it out. I have one long piece from the one I took apart and I'm going to stick that in the middle. I'm going to stick that in the middle. It's like too many cream flowers together there. Okay, my other full one. some of the shorter ones to the front a little bit. <laughs> you have to play with it to like get your flowers where you want them. Uh, okay, before I do that, here is my pumpkins. I believe these are $5 on sale at Hobby Lobby. So I am placing my pumpkins. Look at the pretty leaves they have attached to them. Uh, they have cheaper ones, but they don't have the leaves attached. And I am using one of those. I have that orange. I have this pretty cream color one. 
Um, I, I bought these for my centerpiece in the dining room, but I'm going to have to, I wanted to use them in here now. Now I'll probably have to go get more. I don't know. We'll see. But, so I want some flowers up here. Kind of empty looking there. Let's see. I need this here. There we go. I think I am liking it. Let's see, put my leaves towards the front more. I'm liking. I think I'm liking. That. I don't want to block your view, but this is how I'm doing it. And this is the pumpkin that comes without the flowers. Now it comes on a short stem like those ones had. So I pulled that stem out and I cut a big, um, the big skewers from like Dollar Tree. I cut them in half and I put up one in here. So I want this like kind of in the middle. I think I need more flowers towards that way. And let's see. Yeah. Let's see. There. Yeah. Kind of like that. Let's see. I think this tall flower needs to go towards the back. around here. There we go. Okay. I think I'm liking that. I'll probably play with it a little bit more. Then for my hook, now I really should have made something. Oh, there's a helicopter flying over. I should have made my sign to hang on there, but gosh darn guys, I'm running out of time for everything. Uh, fall is here. And I need to get decorated. So I got these at Hobby Lobby. I don't even know how much they were. I took the tags off. Um, but they're 40% off. But John and I picked these out. So I am just going to hang this on my hook. I got one of the white ones. And I got one of the orange ones. I might have to play with it to get it straight. But... Let's see if I can pull them here. <laughs> but there's my two flower boxes. Now these go next to my urns um, on either side of my door there. So I'm loving them. I hope you like my little flower box sign um, fall display. Um, I'll talk to y'all later. I'm going to go work on the other side of the porch. I almost have this side done. Um, uh, I had to clean up after the bear. So I'll talk to y'all later. Thanks. Bye.